SOLIDWORKS PDM 2022 introduces powerful new capabilities to keep your designs on time and on budget while keeping your design teams organized and informed. With tight timelines, it's critical to know what your teammates are up to. With PDM 2022, hovering your mouse over the new login profile picture provides quick access to editing the presence note, allowing you to update your activity for the day. Want to know what your teammates are up to? Simply hover your mouse over the username to find out. New for 2022, transitioning from the bitmap preview to the eDrawings preview is now more discoverable with the help of a dedicated button. Interrogating your models is now easier than ever with the eDrawings desktop UI fully embedded. This familiar interface allows access to commonly used commands like the measure tool with all its options. It also provides full access to the component design tree, allowing you to cross highlight between model geometry and the component list. Keeping design costs in check is a fine balance between designing from scratch and reusing past designs. For example, we need an ultralight deck plate for this new design. New for PDM 2022 is the ability to incorporate your licensed XLEAD one part environment into PDM Professional. Exalead One Part is a powerful search and discovery application that allows you to gain deep insight into your vaulted data. One Part not only presents you with the results, but also highlights parts that share a 3D similarity. Selecting all three components allows us to compare them side by side in order to find the part with the least amount of weight. With the part identified, a simple button click opens it in SOLIDWORKS, allowing us to complete the assembly design while avoiding the cost of creating a duplicate part. No design is complete without ensuring the drawings are updated. New for PDM 2022 is the ability to use the open drawing command, regardless of what the drawing is named or where it's located in the vault. This command has been added to the right mouse button menu of the PDM added, allowing you to quickly access component drawings as well. As an admin, bringing new users into PDM is now easier than ever. The Users and Groups node has been consolidated, making them easier to find. The User Property card has been updated as well. For Active Directory users, the profile picture is now imported directly from Active Directory, and there are more user fields available, making it easier for properties to be mapped over. In the Group Property card, administrators can now overwrite the Windows Group name with a more descriptive name, making it easier to identify in the tree. Ensuring company standards is a key capability of SOLIDWORKS PDM. New for 2022 is the ability to block the transition of drawings that are saved in detailing mode. In addition to the transition block, a new system variable has been added for drawings saved in detailing mode. This new variable can be utilized in places like data cards in order to provide enhanced visibility to the state a drawing is in. Receiving supplier designs in the form of neutral formats is an easy way to expedite the design process. New for Web 2 is the ability to fully preview these formats. STEP, IGIS, Parasolid, STL, JT, and ASIS can all be viewed directly in your web browser. Also new for Web 2 is the ability to customize the data card Removing properties like project name and project number from the card view is now easily accomplished in the administration tool. An option called Show in Web Card is available for each property control on the card. Additionally, a dedicated web card editor has been added. This tool allows you to rename fields that otherwise would have displayed the variable name. The layout of the card can be toggled to tree mode allowing admins to drag and drop properties where they would like. Once saved, a simple refresh of the browser updates the view. With new user controls, search integrations, and previewing capabilities, SOLIDWORKS PDM 2022 provides the tools you need to maximize your productivity.